of Purple Bandidos, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Heart Gold. I'm Purple Rodri, and in the last episode, we caught the legendary Pokemon Mewtwo. In today's episode, as you can see, we are back in Johto here in Violet City because we're going to be taking care of another special event around this area. Today, we are going to be doing the Arceus special event, and it's going to be a lot of fun. And let's go ahead inside of here and get our special gift. There's a set of twins waiting for us. There's a red one, and there's a green one. Let's go ahead and talk to the green one. Good day! You must be Rodri! I've received a gift for you! Here you go! So we received an Arceus! Yes, you actually get Arceus as the special event gift. So it's pretty dang cool that we can actually get this Pokemon. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and put it up in front. It's gonna be a very, very big part of this adventure. As you can see, it's level 100. It's pretty crazy that they give you a level 100 Arceus for this event. As you guys know, you could only do this event in the past, so the only way to do it now is by using a special code, which is what I did. Right here it says, East Entrance to the Ruins of Alf. This is where this special event's gonna be taking place. I'm very excited to go here. Never been to the Ruins of Alf before, so this is a lot of new exciting stuff here in Johto. Ouch! Are you okay? I was in a hurry and sorry, did I hurt you? No way! Could it be a Pokemon from Sinnoh? The one they call Arceus? Oh, could it be? Arceus causing all this? I cannot explain it any other way! Arceus may be the key to solving the mystery of the unknown and the ruins of Alf! Can you come to the ruins of Alf with me, please? You must! I am trembling with excitement! I think something is about to happen! Hmm! I have been studying the ruins for many years, but something feels different. Wow! The unknown pictures on the wall! It feels like they're staring at me! What is this? There is something eerie that is making my legs shiver! I can't stop them! Whoa, something mysterious is going on. It seems like we've been teleported to a new area. There is some weird ritualistic triangle up here with three spheres. Don't know what that means, but I don't think we should be in here. Let's get out of the exit and see what, I, what is a hiker doing here. Well, hello. It's so freezing, isn't it? For a youngster like you to be interested in the Sinjo ruins is not something we see every day. Take a look at them. From the design of the pillars of the Sinjo ruins, you can see that the cultures of Sinnoh and Johto have blended. What was I thinking? We don't need to be standing here. Why don't you come to the cabin around the corner for more discussion? Yes, let's go to the mysterious man's cabin for a discussion. That sounds like the right thing to do. By the way, we happen to have a person at the cabin. Any trainer should know who she is. The famous trainer from Sinnoh. She is traveling around to study myths and ancient ruins. Isn't that something? Could it be our old friend from the Sinnoh region? It might be who I'm thinking of. I'm going to be really, really excited if it is. And it is! It's Cynthia! My name is Cynthia. I am a Pokemon trainer. The Sinjo ruins remind me of Sinnoh, where I come from. Initially, I thought it was because it snows a lot here as well. But that was not it. A long time ago, people came from Sinnoh to live here. They must have built a temple here while longing for home. That's why we call these the Sinjo ruins. You are... A Pokemon trainer! I can send strong power coming from your Pokeball! Oh, you betcha! I feel familiar presence! The power of Dialga, Palkia! Or could it be Giratina? It's similar, but not quite the same! Have you got time? Can you come to the Sinjo ruins with me? Call it a trainer's intuition! When you and your Pokemon step onto that stage, something will happen! Alright, so our old friend Cynthia wants us to accompany her onto the stage something weird is happening here she seems to have some intuitive feeling that is telling her that we must go on the stage this is the mystery stage the mythical stage built to show respect for arceus it is said that people used to celebrate its magnificent might with music and dance some people in johto still pass down this tradition the mystery stage allows a single Arceus and nothing else to get on the stage if you wish to go up there you have to deposit your other pokemon in a pc box at the cabin Alright guys, it seems like we can only get on the stage with one Pokemon, and that is Arceus. I'm going to deposit our team into the PC, and I'll be back with you guys once I've done that. 
Alright, so I've gone ahead and deposited all of our team members into the PC. It almost feels a little strange not having them around, but it seems like that's what we have to do for this event. Let's go ahead and talk to Cynthia. This is the mystery stage! She's telling us the same thing as before. As we know, there is some weird ritual that's about to happen here. It says, According to an ancient document, time, space, and antimatter, or whatever combined what we call the world, shall be born when Arcea stands on the mystery stage. This is where one might say, the lead enters the mystery stage at last. All my study of ruins and Pokemon mythology and Sinnoh may have been to bring you up on this stage here today. Depicted on the mystery stage are the Pokemon that shaped this world. The circle in the middle is Arceus, the origin of it all. This is the pattern that represents Palkia, the master of space and dimensions. This is the pattern that represents Dialga, the guardian of time. This is the pattern that represents Giratina, the ruler of the world that is on the opposite side of ours, the world of antimatter. Arceus has accepted you as a trainer. Arceus having shaped the world is set to show you a glimpse of its true power, the power possibly making life appear out of nothing. It seems that something will happen when you choose one of the circles. You'll want to be well prepared. Okay, guys, so it looks like we get to choose one of the three circles here. At the bottom right, we have Palkia, the master of space and dimensions. At the bottom left, we have Dialga, the guardian of time. And up at the top, in the red one, we have... Giratina, the ruler of the distortion world, and that is who I am going to be picking. You can only pick one of these, and something's happening here. The mysterious round object took the shape of a Pokemon. We obtained Giratina! So RC has just hatched Giratina out of an egg, and we obtained it. Let's go ahead and give Giratina a name. As you guys know, Giratina is found in the dark world, in a very dark place. So in an area of pure darkness, what the world needs is a little hope. So that's what we're going to call this Giratina, hope. Shining Sphere! Could it be an egg? Did we just witness the very moment an egg was brought to this world? A moment no one has ever seen? An egg is the cradle of every being. This planet itself is an egg in a sense. Life that comes from an egg will come to an end in due course, to begin anew. That may be what Arceus wanted to show us. That was... We seem to be surrounded by that strong power again. Oh, are you alright? You disappeared right in front of me! I was so surprised! 
I see. The power of Arceus and Unknown affected each other to create a huge energy which sent you to the Sinjo ruins. Unknown, the ruins of Alf and Arceus? The mystery deepens. It has made me even more inquisitive. I will one day solve all the mysteries. Something very strange just happened to us here in the ruins of Alf. This has been a very strange and mysterious adventure, but it seems like we have obtained a Giratina as well from it. Giratina is level one. That's pretty dang cool. It's a ghost dragon. It has dragon breath and scary face. So that's pretty neat that that's how you can actually obtain this Pokemon. If you selected the other two, you would get, you know, whichever one you chose. You can also do this event twice, either with a special event Pokemon or if you use uh, another Arceus that you obtained elsewhere. Okay, so we are back here in Violet City with our Arceus and Giratina. Our team is relaxing in a box. It's been a while. They've never been in there all together, chilling and just having a good time. So it's pretty crazy that, you know, they're not out here with us. Thank you guys so much for watching. It was pretty great to do this event. I can't believe we got to bump into Cynthia. That was actually really awesome. I wasn't expecting that, and it's great to see, you know, good old friends from another region. If you guys have any tips or any suggestions, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.